With this hand I will lift your sorrows. Your cup will never empty, for I will be your wine. With this candle I will light your way in darkness. With this ring I ask you to be mine. Whenever I think of weddings or brides, I always think of Tim Burton's Corpse Bride, so I had to include the iconic vows. Oh, hello! Welcome back to my Chanel, and for today's video, we're gonna be talking about what I would wear for my wedding day. As you may have guessed by my appearance, I am not your average bride, and so today I'm gonna be trying on a white dress, but I'm also gonna be trying on a black dress, complete with veils. And I have four looks to show you today, the bachelorette party, two wedding looks, and then something for the wedding after party. So I am very excited. This video is sponsored by Shein, who provided all of the clothing, shoes, and accessories, so thank you very much. And they have provided a discount code for you in case you want to get anything you see in this video, which I will leave right here as well as in the description box. And that is SWS352 to get 15% off. And everything I show you in this video will be linked down below in case you want to get it for yourself. So without further ado, let's dive in. First up, we have the clear strap platform stiletto heeled mule sandals for $33.10, and I got the color red and size eight and a half American. I fell in love with these shoes the minute I saw them. How could you not? Especially with the roses in the heels. At first I thought these were just for show and they wouldn't actually include the roses, but they did. I love that the sole of the shoe is the exact match for the color of the roses too. Obsessed. What can I say? For my bachelorette party, I want to have a sky-high platform heel and something to show off my mani-pedi. I'm sure I'm going to have some really cute toenail polish for this day. They are very high. And the only thing keeping them on my feet is this little plastic roll wrap around the front of the foot. But these are very comfortable. I love them. I love how spiky and thin the stiletto heel is. And by the end of the night, these will probably come off my feet, but for pictures and at the beginning of the night, they're perfect. Next up, we have the Joy Fineer Crisscross Tied Backless Plunging Neck Split Thigh Bridesmaid Dress for $21.49, and I got the color black. Don't let the name fool you. This is not going to be a bridesmaid's dress for me. <laughs> I was thinking for my bachelorette party, something involving the beach would be really fun. Like maybe going to a club, out dancing, because then I could use the heels, but then kick them off when I go on the beach. This dress is floaty. It is just really lightweight, but it's perfect for dancing in. So I love it. It's exactly what I wanted. And it's also very sexy, which I want to feel sexy on my bachelorette night. <laughs> this fits me perfectly. And I love the construction of this. It's very flowy. It makes me feel ethereal. We have strings that are very stretchy and elastic, and they're very long too, which is great because then I can crisscross it any way I want around my back. And the back is completely open, which I love. Again, very sexy, so it's very me. And with the straps, I just imitated what they did in the picture. So I crossed them across my back and then crisscrossed them underneath my boobs. I feel like that also adds a really fun design in the front, as well as kind of cinching in the fabric so your boobs don't fall out. <laughs> and in the back of the dress, we have a lovely ruched stretchy elastic band going around the back around your waist and then we have two skirts the first which is this beautiful dark black mesh it has a slit in the side as well to show off your leg and this goes all the way to the floor and then underneath that we have a solid black mini skirt to you know give you a little bit of modesty but not too much <laughs> this is a bachelorette after all i will say i do wish the mini skirt was a little bit longer because it just covers my butt but it is appropriate for the kind of party I have in mind. <laughs> so that is my bachelorette look. Now we're going to be moving on to what I would wear on the actual wedding day. We have the Love and Lemonade off-shoulder side-draped wedding dress for $54, and I got size medium. This dress is so gorgeous. This satin, ah, the off the, I can't even speak. I'm so excited. Give me a second. <laughs> the off-the-shoulder cap sleeves, the beautiful side train, like, come on, the mermaid silhouette. This is me in a white wedding dress. And now I'm not planning on wearing a white wedding dress for the wedding day itself, but I wanted to see what it looked like, see what, you know, everyone's raving about. And I have to say, this dress is absolutely stunning, and I do feel very bridal in it. This is a very stretchy dress, which I wasn't expecting, so I probably could have even sized down one, but from waist down, this fits me perfectly. And I just love that big side sash that goes all the way to the ground. 
the drama. <laughs> but I love how long this is. I love how shiny the material is very soft to the touch. And I also love the off the shoulder element to it. So pretty. This zips up the back. And the only thing that I'm not a fan of is that this dress is kind of see-through. So if you're wearing any kind of underwear, even white or you know nude, you will be able to see your underwear lines through the dress. So that's the only thing that I wish wasn't a thing with this one. This has padding sewn into the dress so you don't have to wear a bra, which is lovely. But you can kind of see like the edges of the pads under here through the white part of the dress. So not a big fan of that either, but wearing a bra helped kind of fill it out for me and it made it look a little bit better. And of course, to complete the ensemble, we have to add a veil. And I got the Flower Decor Bridal Veil for $21.90. This veil is stunning. And I wasn't sure how I'd feel about the pearls on it, but honestly, I think it's gorgeous and I love it. I've always wanted a long veil because I went with my best friend to go look at dresses and veils for her when she got married and the long cathedral veils instantly had my heart. So this is a very very long veil. I love how long it is and the lace on the edges is such good quality. I was shocked by how nice this veil is. And this is a single tier veil so it doesn't have a shorter one that you flip up over your face but I love that. I think it's stunning. And it goes really well with the dress because the dress itself, while it is gorgeous, it's kind of plain. There's no lace. There's no accoutrement. So this veil brings the lace details and it just adds a little extra something to it. And this veil comes with a very sturdy metal pin or hair clip that goes right into your hair. And you can wear this with your hair up or your hair down. I chose to wear it with my hair up. But this is a beautiful veil. I think it's perfect with this dress, especially when the wind catches it and it's flowing out the breeze. Oh, love it. And one thing I have to say is that when I was shopping with my best friend and looking for veils for her, a really simple veil that was long like this with no lace, no anything on it, no embellishments, was over a hundred dollars. This is twenty one dollars. I can't, un <laughs> what? <laughs> that blew my mind where she got charged so much for her veil and it was a gorgeous veil but it wasn't anything like this, and this is what, like, at least a third of the price? So we've tried the white wedding look. Now let's try our next look, which is all black. I've been most excited for this one. <laughs> this is the off-the-shoulder ruffle hem satin prom dress for $39.49. I got the color black in size medium. I wanted drama. I wanted a mermaid silhouette, and this delivers everything I wanted. <laughs> I love this dress. It is so stunning. The satin is very stretchy. It's very soft. The amount of train that I have on this dress is insane. This is like something a celebrity would wear on the red carpet and I own this now. This is amazing. <laughs> this has a black mesh slit right in the front which goes down to between your boobies. <laughs> this zips up the back and one of my favorite things about this dress and what inspired me to get this one above all the others that I saw on Shein are the sleeves. I don't know what material this is, but it has some stiffness to it so you can kind of make it go up, make it sit down around your shoulders. But I love the way that it's sewn into the bodice where it has these little ruffles or you know folds and it just looks so elegant because it's off the shoulder. And these go all the way to the back and the back of the dress is cut low so very sexy. This also has built-in cups and I wish I had known just how stretchy this dress would be when I ordered it because I would have sized down at least one. Because while everything from the waist down fits me perfectly, the top is a little big and I kind of had to to keep adjusting myself when I was shooting this so it wouldn't fall down. But I am planning on altering it where I can just, you know, nip in the sides a little bit underneath the arms and it's an easy fix. And my mom said it was very Morticia, which I agree with. So to add to the dress, we have the veil. This is the floral embroidered bridal veil for $35 and look how long this veil is. Oh my god, <laughs> this is even longer than the first one. And this veil has a double tier, which means you have a shorter piece that goes over your head, you know, and then you can flip it up when they say you may kiss the bride. <laughs> this is gorgeous black mesh and beautiful black lace all around the edges, as well as around that second tier. And when I first looked at the picture of this, I thought this looks kind of see-through. It's probably not going to be very heavy. Maybe it's not going to be good quality, but I was wrong. This is a gorgeous veil, and I love that the lace has weight to it where it's not super heavy on your head, but it, it kind of weighs it down so if there is wind, it's not just going to go flying everywhere. 
especially the shorter bit around your face. This also has a sewn in heavy duty metal clip, which you can just put in or out of your hair. You can wear your hair up, you can wear your hair down. When I was filming this, it was a pretty windy day and that clip did not go anywhere. It stayed in my head. <laughs> so I love that. I felt gorgeous in this combination. It is my favorite for sure. So now that we've looked at the bachelorette and the wedding looks, it is time for the wedding after party. This is the off-shoulder mermaid hem prom dress for $37.49. I got the color black in size medium. I wanted something I could dance a little more easily in because I love dancing and every wedding I've ever been to, I always tear it up on the dance floor. So at my own wedding, it will be no exception. <laughs> this is another gorgeous black satin number with off the sleeves. It's very, very similar to the wedding dress that I just showed you but this one has a built-in corset. I love corsets and I like that structure in the dress just to make sure I wouldn't have to keep tugging it up as I was dancing through the night and the sleeves are a lot smaller which will make it easier for me to move around in but we still have that gorgeous mermaid shape. This one also zips up the back and much like the black wedding dress that I just showed you I should have sized down in this because this is also very very stretchy. I was not expecting that and this also has some beautiful ruching and you know wrapping of the fabric around the waist which I like. I think that's very flattering and and for this one, I'm just going to have to alter it again and get it, you know, tightened a little bit just around the top because again, from the waist down, fits me perfectly. But I love this dress and it is perfect to dance the night away in. And I have a feeling some of you will be asking in the comments, no, I am not engaged. This video is just for fun. So that is it for my wedding looks video. Hope you guys enjoyed. I had so much fun picking out these dresses and I'm very happy to have more satin in my life. This material is gorgeous. The one thing I will say though is be careful if you're wearing anything like this outside. The venue that I went to to shoot some of this footage in was gorgeous, but there was a lot of concrete, a lot of of rough material in the planters and on the ground and I noticed that if I brushed up against anything even very lightly it started to pill and like pluck at the dress but just so you guys know if you get these dresses be very gentle with them especially when it comes to anything that's concrete or gravel. As much as I did feel like a bride in the white dress I think the black with the poofy sleeves was my favorite look but let me know which dress you think looked best on me down below in the comments. I was inspired by someone I saw on TikTok this morning to do like a viking ish braid so I like it. I think it came out really cool. <laughs> I am just so happy that the winter season is finally over and wedding season is here, so that means spring. <laughs> for those of you who don't know, I also sing at local churches for weddings and funerals, so I am very excited to get to sing for weddings again. I hope you're having a wonderful day or night wherever you are, and I will see you in my next video. Bye. I'm getting married in the morning. Ding dong, the bells are gonna chime. You fools. Let's get it started. Ha. Which is exactly what I want for my wedding day. My wedding day. Dr. Dre. <laughs> so first up, we have the clear strap platform stiletto heeled. i starting off strong. Let's do that again. If I was a rich man, I would marry myself. <laughs> and in case you see anything you want to get for yourself, they've given us a they've given us a follower. And in case you see anything in this video, you uh, 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 uh,